Of course, you can think about probably many, there's many different ways dealing with the fear. And, and according to this cycle of teaching or Dzogchen cycle of teaching, the fear of not only death, but fear of any kind. It's a fear, it's like an emotion of losing something. And in some sense, some way, probably you're not losing anything because in a way you never had anything, <laughs> right? So, but somehow we feel like we are losing something, we are losing something. So, so, so it's not logic or rationality or anything, but the emotion itself, bringing the light, awareness, presence to the emotion, uh, hosting it, accommodating it, being with it, and rather than being separate from it, looking at it and trying to shut it down. And that doesn't work. I mean, never have never succeeded. But if you come closer, be aware of it, accommodate it, rest in it, being kind, gentle, connect, quiet, peace, no voices, restful, peace. Suddenly, it's gone. It's, it's no longer there. And when it's no longer there, that and recognizing that space, which is absence of fear of death, that it's eternal. Like, it, it, when you're there, you know this will never die. Nothing can ever destroy. This will never change. These qualities are fully present in here kind of feeling that, feeling that nothing's going to, nothing's going to change. Changelessness, we say. More familiarity, awareness to that will help. But many times what we do, we separate from that emotion and rationalizing it, trying to have a logic to not have it. That doesn't work. Sometime might work for short temp short temp short time it might work. The time which hopefully good timing for you. But then even eventually will come back. So but it's not a guarantee. No, so so that's not really a solution. Solution is to to re realize it. <laughs>